Guys, friends, friends. This, this is important. This, this is so important that, oh, hold on. Good evening, officers. Just me, Johnny Law, uh, follower. Please don't hit me. Okay, as I was saying, guys. This is so important. I'm putting my windshield up so you can hear me better. Are you judging me because I was self-conscious next to the cop? about motor vlogging next to the cop. You're judging me, aren't you? I know you are. Anyway, guys, okay, listen, listen to me. I'm worrying you're not listening to me. Listen to me, okay? If you own an Indian Challenger or a Pursuit, I need you, I need you to listen. Loosen your clutch cable, like almost assuredly. Well, maybe not a Pursuit, maybe not a 22 Pursuit, but if you have a 20 or a 21 Challenger, I need you to listen to me. I'm worried you're not listening to me. You need to listen to me. Loosen your clutch cable. Like, if you think it's properly adjusted, you probably should just, like, loosen it a little bit. Uh, because I have 12,000 miles on this Challenger. I've crossed the country on it. Um, I, I, I thought my clutch was, like, in a pretty decent place, but I did think it was a finicky clutch. If, if you go on Facebook or, like, any, well, I, I would say you know, the Challenger forums, but there's no, the Challenger is too late model of a bike. There's no Challenger forums because forums don't exist anymore. There's only Challenger Facebook groups, but I digress. If you go on a Challenger Facebook group and you look up, just type in, go to the little search bar on the top of the, the little blue page there and you type in clutch, right? Uh, it you'll see a ton of people complaining about the clutches on these bikes saying they're finicky saying they pop out saying they wear out quickly saying that uh, they just generally suck they they do have like a really aggressive throw uh, like the the friction zone is very small and it's like pretty far out on the clutch compared to some other bikes and you know I, I had always read that that's what I assumed to be the truth um, you know I I I you know had had just kind of learn to live with how finicky and weird this clutch was and you know I've done I've done mountain road switchbacks on it and you know it had gotten to where it was groaning a little bit here and there you know as I would start to let it out uh, but you know I, I, I ride a lot I got used to it I, I've never really you know thought anything was really wrong with it now I did know that checking you know th th this bike is a little different than some other metrics you may have had in the past like normally how you check, you know, clutch tension, or how I've always checked clutch cable tension, is to, you know, kind of grab the cable and pull it away from the control, and, you know, kind of look at that gap. You know, you should have like a quarter inch gap, and I have always known, you know, you should have like a loose clutch cable, you know, you should have a little bit of play in it. Well, I had originally looked up Indian's suggested play in the clutch cable, and, you know, I, I do admit, I have ADHD. I don't always read things super closely, especially if it's dry information. But I swear that when I was looking at that, okay, it, it said, you know, acceptable play, you know, 0.19 inch, right? So, you know, a, 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 a under a quarter, you know, under a quarter of an inch of, of play. So basically, and honestly, I'm, I'm doing this about as poorly as possible trying to explain this while riding. I can't really look at the clutch cable, but basically if you were to look at the, you know, where the front of the clutch uh, uh, lever, um, you know, comes away from the control, you should have a, you know, under a quarter inch of play on that before the clutch engages. And, you know, that's what mine showed. If, if you looked under the bike where the, you know, the clutch uh, uh, cable is and, and where, where the two adjustment nuts are, um, you know, the part of the clutch cable that's visible, um, you could totally, you know, see it on, 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 you know, you could totally, you know, move it on mine. It had a little bit of play in it. So I, you know, I thought my clutch was good. 
Well, you know, I was looking up online the other day uh, and, and somebody was talking in one of the forums about their clutch burning out awfully quickly. And one of the other members who uh, happens to be Brandon White, the guy that uh, runs the, the Mad Monkey race team, uh, who also has like the basically the best tuning shop for challengers. Um, and I'm going to be sending my ECU to him very soon. Um, the, uh, you know, he said, oh, you know, loosen your clutch cable. Your clutch cable is, is definitely too tight if you're burning up clutches. He said basically every Challenger has too tight of a clutch cable uh, because the stock numbers are way too low. So I looked up Indian's official adjustment video online, which I will link to in the description, and they list 0.19 you know, inches as the acceptable measurement, 2.59 inches. So they basically say that the acceptable swing of this thing could be literally un from under a quarter inch to almost 0.6, you know, well over half an inch of play, which would be ludicrous. Your, your, your lever would feel like it wasn't even hooked up. But, um, you know, so basically Indian's number is is so, such so wide of a, of a, a span that it's it's bordering on you know non-informative i mean they, you know they basically say i don't know things should be loose so you know i went under the bike and loosened it way up and kind of did you know what what uh uh you know he suggested which was to you know loosen it to what i thought was you know about as loose as i would ever make a clutch lever and then went a little past that and then tightened it back up and i gotta tell you I got a whole new clutch. Uh, it engages so much more firmly. Uh, like the, I, I actually thought this bike shifted easy before. Now the shifts are like so smooth and feel so well engaged. I no longer get any groaning from the clutch at low speed. Uh, and it feels a lot more responsive. Uh, even just on a regular old launch without a bunch of power added, like it, it it feels like it grabs more positively it feels like the the friction zone's a little wider um so yeah uh if you are having issues with a finicky weird clutch on your challenger loosen that clutch cable baby two 12 millimeter wrench is all you need pretty easy little process um definitely worth checking out you know you you can tell right away uh that you fix something when you do it you know so you'll you'll know uh you know, if that was the problem. But anyway, uh, as always, keep your head up, boys.